Hi, John Rhodes here. Big welcome and thanks for tuning in. Many of you have asked me how I obturate root canals with an immature root or a very wide apex. And so in this video, I'm going to show you exactly that. We've got a tooth with a very wide immature apex and I'm going to seal it using a bioceramic material, biodentine. Hope you enjoy it. Here you can see the preoptive radiograph of the maxillary right central incisor. It's an adult patient, but the tooth was traumatized when he was younger. And you can see that there's an uncomplicated crown fracture, which has been repaired with composite. The root canal is very wide and the apex open with the periapical radiolucency. Small volume CBCT is invaluable in trauma cases. And here you can see I'm examining the axial view, which shows a wide root canal and a periapical radiolucency that's probably a chronic abscess. This is highlighted nicely in the rendered view. And in the sagittal view, you can again see the immature root with a large periapical radiolucency. We will need to create a very firm matrix barrier at the apex to prevent extruding material. After cutting a palatal access cavity, you can see right down the root canal with the microscope to some granulation tissue at the apex. Irrigation in this case consisted predominantly of 3% sodium hypochlorite agitated with an ultrasonic irisafe tip. I also used EDTA. It's not always easy to get a reliable reading with the apex locator in open apex cases. And so in this situation, I exposed a working length estimation radiograph. After thorough irrigation, it's time to place that collagen matrix. In this case, I'm using hemocollagen, a material by Septodont. Small plugs of the material are placed into the root canal and then plugged beyond the apex until finally I get a barrier at the full working length.
looking down the root canal with the microscope under high magnification, you can see the collagen barrier at the apex. The root canal is going to be obturated with a bioceramic cement, in this case biodentine. Small amounts of the mixed material are placed into the root canal and packed up against the matrix. I take a diagnostic radiograph to check that I am at the full working length, and then continue to backfill with small amounts of bidentine until I'm at the level of the CEJ. of the access cavity can be cleaned with a damp cotton pellet and once the biodentine is set which takes about 10 minutes a layer of compomer can be placed on top. Once this is also completely set a dual cure composite was then used to seal the access cavity completely. So just to recap, here is the preoperative radiograph showing the immature root, open apex and periapical radiolucency. And then the final result showing a good apical coronal seal with the majority of the root canal sealed with bioceramic, biodentine, and then the access cavity sealed with a compomer and dual cure composite. The dentist will restore the tooth afterwards. Well, I do hope you enjoyed that video. Stay tuned because there's many more coming your way. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already. And above all, enjoy your endo.